All right, happy Friday, guys. Little fun Friday strength work with a good little finisher today. So we're gonna start just like we always do. We're gonna get moving with our activate, our CNS prep, and our slow down and control. So I'll give you a quick little overview of what we got going on and then we'll rock and roll. Gosh, I got my shades on still. 7 a.m. class is uh, sunny out on that tarmac. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna get moving just like I said, a little bit of a good warm up. Then we've got three rounds of some good strength work, um, maybe a fun new exercise, and then a little midline work, and then our finisher today. Good little uh, strength session. 7am was loving it out there. So find yourself a spot and we'll get started with our warm up. Let's rock and roll. So what you need guys to start is a dumbbell and we're going to hit six per arm tall kneeling presses. On this one team, we're going to keep that elbow pointed forward lock out overhead and come back to that same position. Okay, so let's hit, uh, let's actually go double knee for this one. Uh, double knees down, core on, same thing. Up and back down for six, two, three, four, five, and one more, six. Beautiful, switch arms. We got six on that other side. We're gonna warm up the shoulders. We got some shoulders today in the workout. We got some core, lots of core. And then we got a little bit of legs. We toned it back a little bit. We got one more. Um, because this week was a little bit rough on those legs. So coming on down to your tummy, we've got our prisoner Superman. So down on the ground, hands behind your head. Come up into that uh, Superman position. Down and up for 15 reps, 15 reps. Seven, eight, nine, 10, we got five more. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, beautiful. Coming on to the side, We've got our dumbbell plank that we've been doing for the last few weeks. So grab something, again, that's light, probably the same you did for your kneeling. We're coming into that side plank position. Lock that dumbbell up over that shoulder, and we're gonna hold for 30 seconds. This round, we'll do 30 seconds on one arm. Second round, we'll do 30 seconds on the other. Good job, guys. Try not let that weight go Pass your body, keep it right in line. Squeeze in tight, 10 seconds to go. That's it. Five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful, come on down. Back to those kneeling presses. The double knee, we've got six per arm. One, two, three, good. Four, two more, five, and six. Awesome, switching arms, six on that other side. One, elbows coming forward still, two, three, four, two more, five, and six. Awesome, down into those prisoner supermans, hands behind the head, 15 squeezes. Two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, five more, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Beautiful. All right, guys, picking that opposite side for that plank. Opposite side, getting that plank position, dumbbell up. Shoulder engaged, and we're gonna hold. 
Hold for 30 seconds, 30 seconds. I love this one. Makes you stabilize that shoulder. Puts a little extra work on that core too. Sick guys. Past that halfway point, 10 seconds. Sick guys, keep holding. Five seconds. Two, one, come on down. Awesome. All right, our next part, part B. We got two rounds. Our first exercise, exercise is a burpee straight arm plank. So coming down to that burpee position, coming up. In the straight arm burpee, guys, I want you coming down into a straight arm plank. Core is on super tight, okay? We're not letting it stand. So we've got four of those guys. Let's go. Down, nice and tight, back up. One, down, tight. Two, down, tight. Three, and four. Grab that weight again, guys. We're going around the world from one hip to the other, up and around. Okay, we've got four each side, eight total. Good, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Awesome. Down to those burpees again. Four reps, guys, four reps. Stay tight. One, two, three. Last one. Four. Grab that dumbbell around the world. Eight total. Eight total. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Woo! All right. Getting the heart rate up a little bit. Now we're going to go into a little bit of Y, T's, and W's. So in a nice athletic position, we're going to be bent over a little bit. Okay? Thumbs pointed up. And we're going to hit a wide position. So coming into this wide position, we're going to do 10 reps. All right, let's go. One, two, three. Keep the traps down. Four, five, six, seven. Good job, guys. Eight, nine, ten. Thumbs pointed uh, down in our T position. One, two. Three, four, squeezing those shoulder blades together. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Double your position. So come into our 90, 90 degree angle here. And we're gonna hit that W on the way back. Two, three, four. Squeeze it again, those shoulder blades. Five, six. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Awesome. Heading on to your butt. We've got our glute, alternating glute bridge. We're gonna hold that glute up the whole time. One leg is up, and we're gonna switch back and forth. Ten each. One, one, two, two. Keep that glute up the whole time. Squeeze it. Four, four. Five, five, sit halfway. Seven, seven, nine, nine, and last one each, 10 and 10. Beautiful. All right, guys, back to those wife T's and W's. One more round of this, and then we're going into our work. Good athletic position, bend those knees. Slight sit forward, thumbs pointed up. We're gonna hit our Y's for 10. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. We're going thumbs down, squeezing those shoulder blades together. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more. Nine, 
and 10. 90 degree angle. Last one, we got our W's. Let's hit it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Awesome. All right, last glute bridge coming down to the floor. We're gonna hit second round, 10 total on this one, guys, 10 total. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, beautiful. All right, guys, that's our warm up for today. Grab a drink and let me show you our first speed and power block of work. We've got three exercises. I'm gonna have our clock on. We've got three minutes to complete the three exercises. Okay, three minutes. We have 12 decline push-ups, 12 alternating single-legged squats, and 12 dragon flags. Hmm, what's that one? This one's a new one, this one's cool. We've done something similar in the gym. We'll give it a go today, okay? I'll show you the exercises, but main point is trying to hit full range with tension, control, and power today, okay? It's all about a strength day, making sure we're getting good quality movements. And to decrease the difficulty, guys, we can add resistance. I'll talk about that um, in a second. So let me show you our three exercises. We've got decline push-ups. So we're going feet on a bench, a couch, a chair, whatever we got, if we can, into that deep climb position, want to come all the way down, all the way up. Option for this one, if that's a bit challenging, still in this position, but coming to those knees, down and up, okay? If you want to make it even more challenging, feet on the bench, grab a weight, put it on for your 12 reps, okay? All right, next one, we've got our single leg squat. Alternating, get that one leg out in front, come down, Drive up, switch legs. Lift that leg up, come down, drive up. If you want it a little more challenging, grab that weight, okay? That's our second exercise. And our third, check this one out, team. You're gonna bring those hands all the way onto that bench and hold it, okay? Legs are coming up, legs are coming up, and you're leading with your legs. Lead, 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 and down. Okay? Try not to let your butt lead. Let those legs lead and lower. Option for that one, guys, is that one's a bit tough. Coming up, bend the knees. Still lowering slow, but you have less of a pull with the legs. You got the knees bent. Okay? So those are our three exercises. We've got our push-up on a bench or something to get our feet up, our knees up. Then we've got our single leg squat. Then we've got our fun um, core one. If you don't have a bench or anything to grab on, okay, you can try and use your dumbbell up overhead, coming on up. Let the leg butt come down and just lower. Okay, come up, butt down, and lower. Kind of like a leg lift for that one, okay? Okay, let me get our clock on for three minutes. We'll get set up, and then we'll rock and roll. Three exercises, three times through for quality, guys. We want to make these good reps. Okay, nine minutes on my clock. My Spotify has been crashing all morning. I don't know what's going on. We are going music list today. 
Sorry, you gotta hear my voice the whole time. Okay, now that's on that clock. Get ready for those push-ups. We got three minutes. All right, Tim, going to 10. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Three minutes. Come on, guys. 12 good push-ups. That's it, team. Come on. Make it tough. Make it challenging. We got our single leg squats next. Single leg squats. Grab that weight if you want to make it harder. We've got six each leg. Six each leg. Alternating down and up. Twelve total. That's it, guys. Good. Keeping that balance. Nice job, team. We got lots of time, guys. Three minutes. Nice work, guys. Come on. Sit. All right. Yes. All right, once you're done those 12 guys, we're moving on to that core. We've got 12 the dragons or our leg lifts. 12 reps, guys. Lots of time, 90 seconds. Grab that dumbbell or bench and let's rock and roll. Grab a drink. And we'll rock and roll. Set two. Woo! Hold your top. All right. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's do those push ups. 12 reps, guys. 12 reps. Come on.
those dragon's legs to the bit. Let's rock and roll. Round three, team. 12 push ups, 12 push ups. Let's go. That's it, guys. strength work. We've got two more to go. Our next 12-minute block of work is coming your way. This is only one round, but we've got bigger chunks of work. Bigger chunks of work. Crush the midline and it's called. One time through. 12 minutes is our uh, time pack. Okay. We've got 50 reps, 50 reps of either a single arm dumbbell overhead squat, okay, or we can sub a front rack squat. So this is 25 each side, 50 total squats, 50 total squats. We're going for good quality range on this one, guys. Don't rush it. Then we've got a hundred windshield. Usually we call these windshield wipers. Um, I'll show you guys those again. Hundred reps. This one's going to take us a little bit of time. The morning crew was loving this one. Then our last bit of work we've got is a uh, two hundred feet uh, walking overhead lunge or on the spot. Okay, I'll kind of show you guys all those three exercises. We're gonna have 12 minutes to get it done. 12 minutes to get it done. I think everyone, um, everyone pretty much got it done in the, the time, so we should be good to go. 
Okay, so options for your squats. You've either got a single arm, okay, overhead squat, 50 reps. You're gonna hit 25 on one side, switch arms, 25 on the other. Other option is front rack, only one dumbbell, okay? Front rack position, 25, switch it over, 25, okay? Then our windshield wipers, I think we did these last week or the week before. No dumbbell, hands are just gonna be out to the side, okay? Feet up in a 90 degree position, and we're just gonna let them drop from side to side. Okay, option for this one guys, bend the knees, side to side, okay? The goal for this one guys, sometimes I see a lot of the legs coming forward a lot. Let's try and keep them up as high as we can in that 90 position. We really wanna work those obliques and not put too much pressure on that low back, okay? 100 of those. Then we've got 200 feet of walking lunges, okay? Depending on our time, I might change this up as we go, but you're gonna get one, one arm up, okay? We're gonna go 30 lunges on one arm, 30 lunges on the other, okay? That's what we'll start with. I'll see how it goes. We'll, we'll, we can change it up, um, but we got 12 minutes to do it, okay? 50, either overhead squats or front squats, 100 wipers, and then we've got our 30 each side, each arm lunges. All right, let's get 12 minutes on that clock.
front rack squat team. Let's do it, guys. Join these tough reps on this Friday. Windshield wipers are next if you're done. Did I catch anyone? Oh. <laughs> All right, 50 down for me, 50 to go. Six minutes left, guys, lots of time. Windshield wipers and then our walking lunge and we are done part three. All right. Keeping that core tight, guys. Reminder, bending those knees is that option. If that straight, straight leg gets a little bit challenging. All right, 50 more for me. Let's go, team. Let's go. This one's a tough one. Got to grind through it. Nice work, guys. Stay tight, use those obliques.
All right, 75 for me, 25 to go. Last bit of work, guys, last bit of work. Let's get these done. Woo! Let's go. Obliques are gonna be on fire after this. If you're done, you're hitting those lunges. One arm overhead, 30 each arm, 30 each arm. That's it, guys. All right, we got three minutes, guys. 30 each, 30 each arm. We're alternating those legs. Let's see if we can get it done. Come on, Kurt. Oh, midline, she's crushed. All right, last three minutes, guys. 30 lunges on one arm, 30 lunges on the other. Keep that elbow tight to that ear. Arm is locked out. Burn in those legs. Come on, team. Two minutes on that clock. Two minutes to go, guys. Oh, almost there, team. Almost there. I think 30 per arm is plenty. That's a lot of reps. A lot of reps. That's it, guys. 90 seconds. One minute on that clock, guys. One minute. Job team. Almost there. 20 to 30 reps. Each arm is good. I'm going to hit five more each. Finish with those lunges. Three, two, and one. Well done, guys. That was a tough one. That was a tough one. Windshield wipers and those lunges. Great job. Grab a drink, take a breather. We just have a finisher to go. A little finisher to finish. Our finisher today. Five rounds, 
in 12 minutes of da, 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 da. Ten alternating pistols or single-legged squats, just like we did in our strength circuit, guys. Um, but this one's going to be a little bit faster. So if you were using weight, um, no weight, or um, you can sub for air squats too, as you as if you want. Okay. Goal of this one, guys, is to be a little bit faster. So choose the option that uh, would keep you going pretty quickly for ten reps. Then you've got ten handstand push-ups or hand release push-ups. Then you've got 10 dual dumbbell snatches or single arm snatches, okay? 10, 10, 10 is your uh, lucky number. Okay, so reminder on a few of those exercises. Pistols we did, um, like I said, in the strength circuit, so you can either use the bench or if you're comfortable doing it, um, with no bench, or you're just hitting 10 air squats, full range though, um, standing all the way up at the top, okay? Then you're hitting either 10 handstand push-ups or hand release push-ups. Reminder, hand release, releasing those hands on the floor, driving back up, okay? Feet stay on the ground, body stays in one line, and we're pushing up for 10 of those. Then we've got I don't have two dumbbells here, but if you are using two, you can hit the ground, drive up. That's a dual dumbbell snatch, or you can hit just your single alternating dumbbell snatch. Okay, three exercises, 10 reps for each. We've got 12 minutes to hit five rounds. Get yourself set up. We'll get rocking for our fun Friday finisher. This one, guys, all about speed. Trying to get through these rounds as quick and as, as efficiently as possible. Getting ready for those 10 alternating single leg squats. One second. Now we're ready. 10 seconds, 10 seconds. Five. Let's go. Ten single leg squats or ten squats. Come on. Going for speed on this one. Good. Five rounds. That's it. Ten push ups. Ten push ups. Sit, guys.
nine minutes. Feet on the ground, core tight. Ten push-ups.
Sarah, let us know when you're done those five rounds. We want to see that sweaty face. Good job, Janice. Way to push me on that pace. Nice work, guys. Sarah's still going. Young. Yeah. Done. Great job, Sarah. Hey. Crew, we've got some parking lot workouts this weekend. Uh, Saturday is switched to parking lot. Um, instead of the virtual, we weren't getting too many uh, attendees for our Saturday virtual. So we got lots of people coming tomorrow. Um, if you are looking for a class, guys, then you do see that it's kind of full. It helps us if you do go on the wait list so that we can kind of see what, uh, if there are other people that would want like a similar time slot. So if there's something that you're looking for this weekend or next week, um, please do so. Please do so. Have a great weekend, guys. Thank you for joining us on Friday. Thank you. Bye, Bye. Sarah. Bye, guys. Bye, Janice.